Good evening, Squad Power 50k, three turns, why are there only three turns? Because this is the Omega Battle, which is a, a non-event other than the fact of the goodies that we get. However, I'm going to use it as a platform to shock on a few pieces of gear and take my Jedi Ray or my Ray Jedi training up to is that one that I've got lots of? Um, I'm thinking. Oh no, I don't. So what am I missing? I'm missing a Mark Five. Okay, I can live with that. All right, and throw that on as well. That looks like a Mark Four laptop. You can have that. Is that a Mark Three condom? It is a Mark Three condom. You can have that as well. That's a that's a Mark Six. Okay. Oh, oh, which needs two laptops. Have I got two laptops still? No, have I? Yeah. Yay. I need a Mark Eight there to do that one, which is doable. And another stun gun. Uh, Thirteen more pieces there. Possibly, I might get her up to the next gear level next time around. Uh, attacks and abilities wise, she's on sevens. Um, Here's my R2. My R2's maxed except for combat analysis. Doesn't have any gear 12 pieces at the moment, but it's quite quick. Uh, 282, 125 enhanced. 10% of that, of course, is through just being speed mods. And I think a similar thing is here. 252 for my BB-8. Um, only 90 increment there. I don't think any of these boost the speed. And what's that one there? That's a Mark Six with a Mark Five. Oh, wow. Okay, all of those are going to take a while. Um, yeah, here's my BB-8 at the moment. Um, Arc Welder and Illuminated Destiny are the only two Omegas. Everything else is seven. What does that one do then? If all active, uh, active allies are droids, BB-8 gains taunt for one turn. Otherwise, BB-8 and a random ally who doesn't have it gains secret intel. Unique buff for three turns, then BB-8 gains 8% turn meter for each ally with secret intel. Okay. Probably wouldn't make sense for me to read actually all the bits. BB-8 has an 80% counter chance when BB-8 attacks out of turn, he calls a random resistance ally to assist. Okay, so that's what the Omega does there. So I need to do roll with the punches. I don't think I need to do self-preservation because this is more for droids, isn't it? When BB-8 evades, droid allies recover 8% health and 8% protection. Uh, I suppose you could argue that... Uh, R2 would benefit from that, but yeah, it ain't happening at the moment. None of them are, because I'm saving. <laughs> Yay. As I say, I know it's a bit of a non-event. It just... Well, yeah. It enabled me to do two things. One, test out my uh, recording and the voice over the game noise. Secondly, um, just as a platform for the for taking her up one level. I mean, it's a small increase. But obviously it's a step along the way in the right direction because she does look interesting and I think you know by now if I get the option of running I mean chances are she is going to be meta or already is I don't know but on my shard there is a high percentage of either CLS or GK Zaris there are a few squads coming in um, I'm one of the, the Mavericks as such. I've been running a, a Towsing lead and then moved over to a, a Sarge lead uh, with Night Sisters. So, and I've switched the squad around a little bit as well.
as my Omega. Takes me up to the princely sum of 18 of them. Yay. Um, yeah, that's it. That was me gearing up Ray Jedi training from gear level 8 to gear level 9. Thank you for watching.